pubic hair on my back! It still haunts me. SHUT UP! Ha ha ha, Tune! How lucky you are I was walking by? How lucky you are that I like soup before drugs and I was out of soup? I don't feel very lucky. Well, you are! I'm the guy out of soup! You're upset. People that attempt suicide often are. Want to get something to drink? Nah. Booze ain't the answer. I'm not talking about booze. I'm talking about wine that an old Subway token friend makes from banana peels. It tastes horrible, but it provides a false happiness. And after real happiness, isn't that the best type there is? I got a lot turning over in my head. Like an industrial clothes dryer. The kind you see in the basement of a hotel for sheets and such. I know the type. Front loading, right? Hell yeah. Okay, what's going on? Uh, I went out last night, like I do. And I found myself in some dude's pocket. End of the night, I get dumped on his dresser with his other coin. Well, you know me. I start talking to this other coin, and in no time, we was getting down. All was all right until the morning when the lights came on. So, you want to get some breakfast? It was a guy. And he was ribbed. I suppose for my pleasure. I can see you're in pain, but you don't need to be embarrassed, not with me. Because I've been there, and worse. I was once put in a stripper's G-string. A male stripper. That's not worse. It's bad, but it ain't worse. It's worse for me! You lead a deviant lifestyle. Things like that aren't in my world. I had pubic hair on my back! It still haunts me. All right, all right. I guess we both have had some funky secrets. Indeed. Indeed. Shall we toast to them with some banana wine by the river? Why not? I wouldn't mind getting a taste of spermicide out of my mouth. Truth be told, mine wasn't all bad. The gentleman dancer was a meth addict. As he sweated, I got a bit of a contact high. Man, you way messed up. I won't be judged by a coin that spent the night with a latex sheath. Thank you. Do I say you're welcome to that? 